Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Sagittarius. This is for Sagittarius Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for the month of April. It could happen at any time in April. Things can change in an instant, Sagittarius, so keep that in mind. Uh, right now, you may be shut in. Doesn't mean you're going to be shut in the whole month of April. Okay, I don't know where that message is coming from, but it just came out of my mouth. So I'm not sure what is going on, but what do we have for Sagittarius? What do we have for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for April? Ooh, judgment reverse. You may be unaware. Somebody is unaware of something. Not listening, not answering the higher call. Uh, a need for advice, not listening to any advice, refusing. There could be somebody here that is guilty, okay? The judgment reversed. They may be guilty or maybe being found guilty. I'm not sure if it's you or somebody that you're dealing with. You could be dealing with a Scorpio. It doesn't have to be. This is being ashamed or feeling shamed or guilty, poor health, maybe even doubtful. Totally unaware of the truth. Somebody could be completely unaware. There could be a lack of forgiveness. Somebody's not getting any forgiveness. There's no chance. There's no chance not getting another chance. No chance in reconciliation. Um, somebody's not telling the truth. Okay? And they may be found guilty. I don't know if it's you or somebody that you're dealing with. Um, there's a lack of absolution as well. That means something isn't over yet. Something's not over. Uh, but there's a big opportunity coming. You may not have received it yet. Um, this may have to do with money. Somebody may be uh, doing something that is against the law. Just saying. I'm not sure if it's you or somebody that you're dealing with. The, you know, this is a card of karma. Okay. This is a karma card. Okay. So this is bad karma, bad luck, consequences. Uh, for not doing the right thing. So somebody may be suffering some karmic consequences for not doing the right thing. Okay? Not sure if it's you or somebody that you're dealing with. But this is bad karma. Now this is a yes. A yes answer to something. This is an opportunity that is going to come to you or to somebody else. Now this is a golden opportunity. And there's something to do with money or stability or security. So there's a golden opportunity for security here. But somebody isn't telling the truth. So keep that in mind. I'm not sure if it's you or somebody that you're dealing with. But there is a golden opportunity here. Big one. This is potential. that You're, you're going to be given an or this was a gift. This is a gift, but somebody is totally unaware of this gift. They're unaware of this golden opportunity. So we could have somebody here that is clueless. They're clueless. Hmm. It's a golden opportunity here. With somebody that probably has money. Okay, this person has money. Uh, there, there could be a golden opportunity to start your own business. This could be a new business, but this is 10. 1 plus 9 is 10 of pentacles for financial security. But this is lack of awareness. So Sagittarius, we have somebody here that is completely unaware. Totally clueless. Totally unaware that there's a golden opportunity for financial security. Okay? This person is financially secure, stable, uh hard worker, self-sufficient, just enjoying life. Look at this person is has nothing to worry about. This person is very comfortable where they're at and it looks like uh this this comfortable person is getting something a new offer. So this person is getting an offer. This one right here, because you know it's being given to this person. This person who is a very hard worker doesn't quit, is receiving an offer. This person is receiving something. Big money by the looks of things. Now this is financial success. It really is because that equals a ton of pen. Big payout. And this is permanent. This is a permanent thing. Very, very, very comfortable. Somebody could be getting an inheritance even. You may be completely unaware of it. This could be a passing on of money. 
money could be being passed on or gift. A, somebody is getting a gift from somebody that is well off. This is lack of awareness. <laughs> Some curl. Somebody is definitely getting a gift. Okay. It is the truth. Okay. This is hard work. Pays off as well. This Knight of Pentacles happens to be moving. Usually the Knight of Pentacles isn't moving very fast, but this guy's moving. He's moving, making moves, working hard. He has a plan. It looks, by the look on his face, it's like, I have something big to offer. I have something solid. I have something permanent. This is, this is very stable. This is very real. So Sagittarius, you are getting something from somebody that could really grow because this can grow. This can grow. I'm telling you what. It can grow into something very permanent and long-term and stable. I don't know if it's a job opportunity or what, but or money could be it could be some sort of gift of money, it could be an inheritance or I don't know what. But this 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 Knight of Pentacles, this is uh, building financial security. I'm telling you what. Oh, look at that! But look at this. So this is funny. It's not funny, really. The the temperance reversed is bad behavior. I don't know if you're dealing with an earth sign. You could definitely be dealing with an earth sign, a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. You could be, but it feels like you, this is this is uh, engaging in negative patterns, not doing the right thing. So I'm not sure you, you know, I'm not sure what's going on here. This person may choose to give their money to somebody else. Or choose to give the opportunity to somebody else. This is bad behavior. This is going overboard. A need to re-examine. So yeah, we got some inappropriate behavior here. And this is not learning a lesson. And this is bad karma. So, you know, you got to be careful. It feels like you you could be losing an opportunity to somebody else. Somebody else may be taking your opportunity. If you're going overboard, this could be drugs. It could be addic addictions getting in the way. Lack of patience. Trying to take somebody's money by the looks of somebody. Maybe trying to... You know, take somebody's money and they should be, this is guilty. This is guilty. It is. They may not be doing the right thing. Somebody may be doing something that is against the law. They're, they're, they need to, they're, they're, they're going to pay for it. You may pay for it. You may pay for not being realistic or not compromising or not doing the right thing somebody and i don't know if it's you or somebody that you're dealing with somebody is not uh doing the right thing and they're going to pay for it they're going to pay for it because this golden opportunity is going to be given to somebody else um oh it is it's like we're not going to work with you anymore three of pentacles reverse somebody could be terminated they're not going to work with you there's no teamwork there's a lack of togetherness uh, somebody um, didn't prove to be who they said they were going to be. And now they're losing their power. We have a master manipulator here, a liar, a thief. This person is very cunning, very, very skilled at manipulation. So we do have a manipulator here that is, is being... Uh, this guy is feels like he was trying to steal money or trying to take money or thieving some kind. I feel like he's thieving, but he's, he wasn't, uh, following the plan. You know, this is a plan here. Somebody wasn't following the plan. Now there's going to be some upheaval. There's chaos. There is karma. There is karma. This is paying a price as well. It's almost like somebody is going to have to pay. So, I don't know who it is. Somebody is going to be paying a hefty price and it's a karmic price. Somebody is going to be paying a price for not doing the right thing. For lying. For manipulating. Yeah. 
So we have somebody here that is that is uh, losing their power. They've abused their power, power, and it's like now they're being found to be not qualified, not qualified for the job, not qualified, not qualified, not qualified. So somebody is is it's like somebody is getting somebody else's job. This person has plenty of money. Plenty of money. Plenty of security. Oh my God. She does. She absolutely does. The queen of... I knew that she did. She's very stable. She's holding on to her money. She's holding on to her security. We have. We, you're dealing with an earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This person is well off. She is well off. So this person has money. She has security. She's long-term. She's long-term stability. She's stable. She's very, very, very stable. So I feel like there is this, this, I mean, this is all about security and stability and somebody, somebody, the three of pentacles reversed. They don't work well with others. There's lack of ambition. There's a need to refocus. There's a lack of respect. Somebody hasn't respected this queen. There's a level of disrespect. They lied. And they disrespected this queen with the money. Now she has the money. She has the security. She's she's getting some sort of offer. This is an opportunity for something big. This opportunity is big. It's huge. It's 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 an op. It's a long term. It's an opportunity for long term stability. But it's like there's a lack of respect. This person lied. Somebody lied to this queen, and now she's holding on to her money. I feel like she's going to be giving it to somebody else. She's she's very grounded. She's very realistic. Very practical. She's a businesswoman. So this is a business person that uh, is very comfortable. She's comfortable. She doesn't have anything to worry about. She's not worried about it. And it feels like she's just holding on. She's holding on to her money. She's holding on. She's not giving it away. She's not going to give it to somebody who doesn't respect her and lies to her. And um, abuses their power and manipulates and does things that are... unrealistic i mean this is this is somebody who is is pretending they won't compromise doesn't mix well with others doesn't work well with others doesn't take orders this guy was trying to take some sort of money looks like he's got some ugly look on his face it feels like he didn't do the work yet this is being this is karma this is being found guilty completely unaware i feel like the this person was planning on taking some money or something like that and now there's a rejection hmm there's an op this is happiness there's an opportunity for growth there's there's an offer because this guy's got the golden opportunity in his hand. He's got the money or the situation or the stability. He's hold, He's got some sort of money in his hand. There's an opportunity for growth. There's an opportunity for happiness. But there's a lack of truth with the judgment card. Somebody's not telling the truth. Somebody may be pretending because the temperance reverse. They're pretending. They're lying. There's pretending about happiness. Pretending they're happy, but they're not. Something is coming to a stop. This is unrealistic. We have a queen here that is not satisfied. She's not satisfied. This is dissatisfied. She is not satisfied. And therefore, something is coming to a stop. This is coming to a dead stop. Something is coming to a stop. This queen is putting something to an end. She's stopping something. Somebody right in there. She's not going to give. This is a dead end. 
It is a dead end. There's no more growth. And somebody was pretending that they were happy or they're pretending that this was bright. They were pretending that this was a beautiful situation. It feels like they were pretending. They were pretending that this was a stable, solid offer and it wasn't. Now this queen is holding on. She's holding on to her money. Now this, this chariot reversed is lack of discipline. There could be some upcoming car issues. There's disaster. It feels like there's disaster ahead or an emotional outburst ahead. Because somebody didn't put in effort. They didn't do what they said they were going to do. And now they aren't getting what they thought they were going to get. The opportunity is being given to somebody else. Are being held on to this it's, it's actually in this person's hand it's like i'm holding on i'm holding on to my money so we have somebody here that is holding on they're holding on to their money something is coming to a stop somebody's going to be stopped right in their tracks this isn't realistic there's no there's no growth here it's not practical I'm not going to invest in something that's going nowhere. So somebody's deciding not to invest. They're putting it to a stop. Something about, uh, there's a waiting, maybe waiting till summertime. Something about summertime. It's not time. Let's work, wait until summertime. So something may, may change in the summer. Summer is significant here. Let's stop. Stop this until summer. Now, this is a lack of uh, not putting in any more money. So somebody is deciding not to put in any more money. Stopping this. Because of the manipulation. Because of the lies. This will be like starting over in the summer. Something is going to start up in the summer. Right now, things are stalled. They're stopped. But in the summertime, when summer hits, things are going to blossom again. Things will start over this summer. So there could be a delay right now. And this may have to do with karma. There may be a delay in money coming in. This person is holding on to their money. They're not giving them their money. But in the summer, things start back up. Somebody is definitely walking away. They feel betrayed. There's a betrayal. There's been a betrayal. Somebody is walking away. We have a hostile situation here. We have somebody that has no morals and has no conscience. They don't care who they hurt. They're only out for themselves. So the other person is turning their back and saying goodbye. I don't want to work with you anymore. So there is going to be a separation here. There's going to be a separation. Somebody is deciding to uh, give their their time and their energy and their, their, their money to somebody else because it's hostile. It's like a hostile environment. Somebody hasn't been telling the truth. They've been lying and I feel like they are seen for who they are. And the person that sees them for who they are says, no more. I'm done. So there is going to be uh, walking away. Somebody's going to get pissed off. Okay, they're going to get pissed off and they're going to just be like, you know what? To hell with you. To hell with you. I'm going someplace else. I'm going to go get my, I'm going to go work someplace else. I don't want to work with you anymore. So I feel like this is very much job related where uh, it's almost like severing ties with, with, with uh, whoever you've been working for, you know? There's been a lot of manipulation. There's been a lot of lies. There's been a lot of uh, unhealthy behavior. Put it that way with the temperance reversed. A lot of frustrations on the table here. There's, it's been a very hostile working environment. And I feel like there's a, a, you know, a separation. I'm going to work someplace else. So that's what I see. And I do feel like there's a golden opportunity waiting for you that could grow into something really solid, stable, and secure. There is. So I see you departing from one situation and by summertime heading into something more fulfilling. So good luck.